Okay, welcome back to our very exciting uh, Ottoman Empire Let's Play. Um, in the last episode we fought the Golden Horde and we lost and won several different battles. The Golden Horde invaded our homeland and we were finally able to uh, just concede defeat to them to get them off our back there. Uh, while the Golden Horde invasion was occurring, the uh, traitors, the Mamluks, uh, attacked us and stabbed us in the back. I did a very bad mistake. I moved my arm into Aleppo here. Uh, I then attacked the Mamluk army at Damascus and of course lost. I'm losing way too many battles. I think... Um, I've got a, gotten a comment about this on the uh, on the uh, forum, and uh, I actually have to start pausing the game. Um, uh, better because uh, I'm just wasting a lot of time. Um, after battles, so I need to start thinking about that. Just change my playstyle a bit and try to be more efficient. Because even one battle won against the Golden Horde would perhaps have turned the entire situation around. I'm also, I've been thinking about getting a, um, a morale, morale advisor to help with the army morale. Uh, I'm going to invest all my magistrates into uh, uh, cultural tradition so we can perhaps get a better better advisor. Four are those? One, two, three. Yeah. And there is a morale guy. Uh, the the Grand Captain. We are going to hire a Grand Captain and we are going to place him in our slot here. What was his name? I do not remember. He was three stars. Morale of armies plus 0 0.15 Uh, yeah, well, every little bit helps, I think, so let's just hire him. We have enemy incursions. The Algerians are uh, standing here with an army besieging Morea. I have to get rid of that. The Algerians are allied to the Mamluks, or I think they are vassals, actually. Um, <coughs> Yeah, they're in a personal union with Tripoli. So if I could get Tripoli out of the war, that would be very beneficial. I'm going to try to get them out of the war as soon as possible. Also, we have a truce expiring, a very dangerous one. The Timurids expires next month. So. I've been thinking about this. I need to get my um, army out of here because the Mamluks are coming along here with 16,000 and uh, they will beat us. They will uh, crush this army if I. So I need to save as much as possible of this. I don't have time to take Aleppo at all. No chance. So I'm going to try and evacuate them. I need all my ships in place first. Yeah, well, the stories this game creates. Uh, the last episode was actually one of the best episodes I've ever made as a Let's Player, I think. It wasn't good gameplay, but it was a great episode. Um, it was a great story. Let's get some cavalry out of there, because uh, we need to be able to use the combined arms bonuses 
We're building way too much cavalry. We should have no, not not there. We should have more infantry, I think. And uh, our army here is doomed. I don't think they will get out in time, so I just have to accept that. But we are going to build more. We have a royal manpower manpower number there, so we'll we'll be okay, I think. We just need to um, take care of the Timurids now uh, and just get a peace treaty together with the Mamluks and the Tripolitanians as soon as possible. Let's start to try and evacuate the troops from Aleppo. The Aleppo operation was stupid. I admit I shouldn't have gone there. I should not. They are coming here. Uh, we will have time for this evacuation here. There are some uh, Mamluk ships operating here. We also have a ship here. We're going to go take them out. We still have a we still have a fleet so okay I could perhaps get those four thousand out too all the Mamluks will be coming soon so I think these are doomed the four thousand there okay here come the Timurids now we have fourteen thousand men here uh, under our Sultan we're going to move those here we're going to actually fight a very defensive war uh, against the Timurids. We are going to try and fool him into our uh, country here and just try to beat his armies one by one. Uh, I hope to, that it will work. Yeah, let's get that, those soldiers off now. The Mamluks haven't showed up yet. Ah, oh, here they are. Yeah, these these guys won't have time to leave. Not at all. No, no, no. Nope. They are now. They are destroyed. They're out of the game. So no matter. Um, we now need to send the navy to clear the uh, coasts of the uh, Mamluk ships here. Um, what? What was that? Never seen that before. Okay, we lost there. Our army is destroyed over there. Yep. We are building new troops. Let's check our... Do we have 28 regiments? We can feel a whole lot more. <coughs> we can field up to 41, so we're going to build troops. Um, I don't remember how many I'm building now, but let's go with this and see uh, the Timurids will be coming soon. Are they all with anyone else? Nope. We're the only ones, so they will be concentrating the full force of their empire against us. I'd really like to break this siege too. There's a lot to be done here. Let's just take it easy. Pause a lot. Check the situation. These guys are assaulting. Two, two cavalry units, mostly infantry. Let's combine these and make an army here. Sea of Crete has been won. Let's continue up there. <coughs> and uh, perhaps ship these ones over to Morea. We have a general. This army is commanded by the Sultan himself, but we have Errol. If he didn't die in the battle. No, he's still there. Thank God. 
He was here, he was at Aleppo. He's still useful. Hmm. Yeah, I should send those over to Morea. Just try to get the war over with these. Um, no, they won't accept. And the Mamluks won't accept. Nope, of course not. Let's continue. No sight of the Timurids as yet, but their advanced guards will soon pop out there, so we'll be prepared. The Battle of the Sea of Marmara has been concluded. We won. We're now going to ship these 5,000 over here and get them into Morea, which has now fallen. We also have a Tripolitanian army on Crete, which has also fallen. It's hard to see, but it's occupied by the uh, Tripolitanians there. We are building troops, we are building lots of them and we will continue to build them. We can support 41 regiments, that's a whole lot. We have good manpower. Here comes someone, who's this? Achaea? We are not at war with Achaea, no we are not. Now we will ship our troops. We will take these 6000 here and get them over. These are infantry regiments, can join up with the, uh, the uh, er Eros army there. No sign of the Timurids yet. Oh, here comes someone. An Algerian fleet of 18 ships. Mm. We are 19 ships. I think we can beat them. I think there's a Tripolitania fleet there too. We can't beat both of them. We cannot. Um. It will arrive here on the September. 15, which is a couple of days. Can I retreat into uh, Athens just to check check what the Tripolitanians do, if they turn around or if they're coming for us? And then perhaps attack. We have 12 galleys. He has 13. So that is a battle we might lose. I'll try to get those over the straits here, but I think we're yeah, we got over, but um, that didn't actually help much because uh, we can't get to uh, <coughs> Maria anyway. We need access from this country, the Achaean country here. I think we could get that. Yeah. <clears throat> Go here. No Timurids. No Timurids at all. What are they doing? Nothing. It's weird. Okay, they'll be coming. We're we are their only enemy right now, so can I get a peace treaty with them? Are they tired of this? They won't be. No. I'd really like to get out of the uh, useless war with the Mamluks. And I would not like to pay them anything or give them any provinces at all. I can get my army in here so I can take Maria back at least. Let's see. Okay, the Algerian fleet left. That's good news. At least. No Tripolitanians, but we have a small Mamluk ship up, up there. Unite these, 
10,000. I'd like 15,000 per army here. So, yeah. We need to build those too. <clears throat> I will need to ask for access through this. It hurts, but I'd need to do it. Uh, if they'll give me. I think they will. They are a small nation. Uh, where is that? Ask for military access. Very likely. I will do that. I can then defend my homeland at least. Ah, it's not done yet. There we are. No Timurids. It's a bit scary to sit here and wait for them. No Timurids at all. <coughs> Ooh, here they are. 13,000 Timurids coming in there. This is just the advance guard, I bet. Trib is on. Move the armies up. No, that one isn't fully built. I'll wait with this one at Angora until these guys come along here. Oh, he's turning around. Let's just get those in there too. He's going for Trebizon, isn't he? Okay, Marmara has been cleared. Let's get into Traki then. That major Algerian fleet does worry me. The Algerians were famous for their fleets. Uh, they had lots of... Uh, they were the... well... The, what were they called? The North African... the Barbaresque pirates. Uh, so, yeah. I'd like to get into those provinces later on, but not at this point. We need to save the Empire first from this dramatic situation. Let's build a new army in y Yasgod there. Just stay away from the borders there. Um, that army is just 10,000 still, so I will put these guys together. This guy is going here, these two are also going here. 13,000 coming in there. I think I'll let him come, then charge him. Yeah, <coughs> looking good. Looking dramatic. Okay, he's putting on a siege. I can't see any other troops. <coughs> None at all. Let's now unite these, move them up to see us finally. I'd really like to get Morea back so I can move uh, Move these 6,000 to the peninsula here too. Let's now go for Trebizond. Oh, he's moving out. Denmark has warned us. Why? He will go out on November 24. We will come in on November 25. So that won't help. He will get away. Ah, now he's staying. I hate these situations when it starts working like this. He gets out on December 6. I get in on December 7. Okay. We'll go to... Uh, we'll go to Trebizond nonetheless then.
Let's get the fleet out again because we have a problem there again. Lots of small Mamluk ships going about here. Could I go with the 11,000 strong army into... No, I want to strengthen it first. It's now at 13,000. Can I capture him now? December 20, he gets out on December 29. Yeah, I could capture him, but I don't know if it's dangerous. Oh, no. Yeah, that's perfect. Okay, yeah. My battles are really going badly. I mean, I am the worst warrior ever. Okay, at least we're taking out the Tripolitanian fleet there. We're losing men like butter in the sunshine. Errol will get in on uh, January 10. Now that's lost. I again uh, refuse to follow the plan and just wait for him to come in here. So that means a battle lost again. I'm really the crappiest warrior ever. Well, as usual, we will fight them on the beaches then. Nope, you go here. We are going to build... Oh, we are at our support limit now. 39 regiments. It's really bad. That battle will be long over, so I need to stop these troops from going in to be massacred as well. I need to pull back now. Just retreat. Okay, A against C has been won against the Tripolitanians. Then go into Athens to repair. Could we storm this? No, not at all. Oh, yeah, we could. That wouldn't be half bad. Okay, we are losing on the Eastern Theater again. It's just, it's just too excellent. Just too excellent to be true. Okay, here comes Tripoli with something. Nah, we won't seed anything. I would decline that crappy deal. Yeah, we are really losing badly now. Here comes our allies at least. They will strengthen us a bit. We have a five regiment strong army there. 6,000 coming in here followed by 16,000. 47,000 fighting us there. We have no chance to fight that. Can't they just retreat now? Just save what's left of it. Timurids are going for Sivas. We have 19,000, including our allies. They are coming in with... We could take them, I think. I hope. Yeah, it's really a dramatic situation we're at. Our war exhaustion is not really as bad as I thought it could have been. <sighs> okay, the Siege of Morea. Uh, our assault has failed. Um, okay. I just hope our allies stay there now. 
We'll move those 5,000 in too. Uh, it's a really dramatic situation. I think I'll... 13,000. How much does he have there? He has a lot, I'm sure. They were like 40,000 last time I checked. Okay, we might be winning this actually. We might. Quality wool. 25 ducats. How's our economy going? Ah, so so. Okay, the enemy has landed an army of 4,000. We have 5,000 with bad morale. We might might lose that battle too. Right now we're doing better, but... Those are Algerian troops. Uh, could we possibly... Nah, they won't accept. Nope. They're done, and they are demanding territory, I think, but I won't give them. I won't give them no territory at all. 17,000 moving there. Uh, let's see how this develops. Scotland has warned us? Wow. Oh, yeah. We are not doing too well. Battle of Morea has been lost. Can't believe it. Oh well, we'll go again. We'll go home to... Uh, to recuperate and we'll go again. Our provinces are, are under siege now by barbarians. This battle is really important. We won. For once, we won. Um, so, the Royal Army needs to uh, needs to uh, go here, recuperate a bit, or rather, Sinope. I'll put them there. Errol's army is eleven thousand strong. They are coming in with 17,000 there. I could perhaps join these two armies into a 15,000 strong army and go against Trebizon. Let's get these guys out of here. Go to Athens, rest a bit, and then you go back in. Troops, when you have them in your home territory, they uh, actually replenish quicker. What's that? It's his navy. Ooh, a lot of ships. A lot of enemy ships in there. I don't even dare go out with mine now. Could we just get these out of the war? It would be so much easier then. They will not accept. Diam, diam. Oh well, we have six thousand auxiliaries coming in too. Um, where are you going, Adana, Adana, Adana? Okay, right here. Errol's army is 15,000 strong. I will send it into Trebizond now. He has an army of 13,000 there. I could go get that instead. 15,000 with low morale. Decisions. 
I should possibly take the, out the Angora arm and hope for my allies to come along. Um, but yeah, this has been an exciting episode. I don't think we're doing too well. Um, but yeah, these are the kind of situations I like. But this episode has now come to an end and uh, join me next time as we try to uh, actually uh, make some sense of this. So thanks for watching and cheers.